Hi there, it's Tanya from Tessie Treasures. Hello and welcome back. So today I'm here to do the, the flip through of uh, the junk mail journal. Absolutely thoroughly enjoyed this. Uh, the kit that I've used is called the Flea Market and it's from Pink Monarch Prints. And I've followed along with um, Izzy from Izzy B uh, Creates. I will leave their links um, in the description. So this book is going to be my first ever giveaway in my uh, Patreon. So if you want to put your name down um, to be in with a chance, you do need to be a Patreon uh, just for the month of, of June. Um, and I will be drawing the winner on um, <clears throat> the 10th. No, sorry. The 14th of June. So you've got till the 14th of June to make sure that you've put your name down in, in the post in Patreon to say that you want to be, be in with a chance to win. So let's have a look. So we've it's just tied with Baker's Twine and we've done it that the Baker's Twine comes out um, the spine so it keeps attached. Um, I will as well in the description put the um, link for the full playlist if you've not managed to catch any any of the series or you've missed some. So it just simply uh, ties around. So <clears throat> I've used the, the kit here and um, I believe that's... Um, I can't remember if that's a kit or not. Um, yeah, I can't remember. Uh, that bird is from a book and then I use these frames, what I got from AliExpress and I think a lot of the labels will be uh, Tracy Fox labels. So open it up and we've got a pocket with just two tags inside. There's um, calico on the inside of, of the cover. So the first page, we've got these two little birdies. And there's lots of stenciling um, and things in, in the background. So that's the, the first journal card. I've done all the journal cards from um, <coughs> cereal boxes and, and things like that. So that's the next page. Got a lovely blossom and a butterfly. And lots going off in, in the background. That's another one of those frames. And I think that's a word from Tracy Fox. And there's some butterflies from a book. And then we've got this page with, with the botanical on. That was uh, one of the stamped images that I did with the Tim Holtz Field No stamps. And this is a lovely stamp that the lovely uh, Roseanne sent me. Uh, which was numbers and, and letters. So... That's that tag. Let's just call it there. And then it's backed with the lovely papers from uh, Pink Monarch Prints. Really beautiful kit. I did wonder with it being so soft in that if it would work um, with the botanicals. And it's worked really, really well. Um, this is a stamped image. And again, another stamped <coughs> image on some um, graph paper little pocket there with two tiny little tags in. We've got another journal card uh, tag. Got a nice botanical there and some labels. Window pocket. And we've got that which is just the papers and then just a label. So that goes in there. A couple of butterflies from, from a book. Uh, that one's from a book and then Tracy Label. Um, <coughs> little, what I've used as a belly band, some little tags there. Just got a sticker there. That's another one of the stamp pieces uh, from the Tim Holtz. Got this lovely tag here. I think that's a book plate from Tina at Shabby Dabby Doo -da. Got 
got a sticker there and then a couple of book images. That's another stamped uh, piece that I did on the decorator's paper and I think that's with a Tim Holtz um, stamp. Open, oof, open this up and we've got another big journal card. That's from Tina at Shabby Dabby Doo -da. Nice butterfly. That's from uh, a kit. It's it's not from, from a book. That one's not. Then we've got a bird on the back, which is from uh, a bird book. And a number from Tina. Some stenciling and script stamp. And two more butterflies here. <coughs> and this lovely tag here with some images from book pages and just got a bit of collage there lovely bird here and then we've got this map there so that just pops in there Another botanical image that's from a book, and then we've got a Tim Holtz um, quote there. Lots of different papers behind it, and some stenciling. Here's another one of the frames from AliExpress, and this lovely blossom in a Tina number. And I think we've just got a plain journal card here. Love that paper. So that fits in there. Got a little bit of a cluster here with a, a butterfly and a mini little tag and a ticket. I thought that was a pocket and it, oh, it is a pocket. <laughs> so we've got a pocket here with two tags in and then there's one at, at the back as well. So that's a lovely little blue tip there. And that goes there and they pop in there so <clears throat> they're from the the flea market cat i've got a little butterfly there that number uh stamp again there a bit of washi you can see them through the wind i've put some washi around there just to bring the blue out and then we've got a forget me not here We've got a little tag there. So that's that. We've got a book plate from um, Nanine at College Type there. A sticker and that's another one from College Type. Lots of different collage going off in the back. How does this open? Oh, it opens here. We've got a journal card here just with some uh, butterfly stickers. Tim Holtz washi there, another little book plate from the cat. This is a primrose from uh, a book and a butterfly. And then we've got another primrose here <laughs> on that yellow um, light ticking. Don't know where that's from. Stick that back down. Um, Got another like a little die cut and a label and some butterflies here. And then we've just got a collaged paper there. So as much as there's no writing room, there's plenty of tags, so there is plenty um of writing room on, on the backs of, of the tags. Another uh tip there with all these papers and splashy stenciling and a number stamp. Another little book plate here with a mini um, journal card tag. Got some old dictionary there and a butterfly and then we've got a leaf on there. Yep, it gets a little bit hard to, to get them in towards was the end because it, it's quite quite a little chunky chunky thing and then we've got a nice strawberry there oh i love that one the last page and we've got this tag here 
so that is that so yeah it's been a lot of fun um i definitely want to to make another um i've got a custom order to do to do another one after my holidays but um if you've not seen the video that um well the videos that amy from crafty cat's been doing um she's also been doing an envelope junk journal but um hers she did it with um a lot bigger envelopes and it's absolutely fun fun fantastic <laughs> i think i've just created a new word it's fantastic um yeah so i wouldn't mind um i think i'm going to start saving some bigger envelopes and, and have a go at that at some point so that is is the flip through and like i say this is going to go to to one of my uh patreons to thank thank them for for all their support so that's me for today and I shall see you later. Bye for now.